Did you know what wolves are capable of and where they live? I'll tell you everything now. Nice view. A wolf is a predatory animal from the class of mammals. Multiple studies say that this is the ancestor of the dog. More recently, they could be found in different places of our planet in Eurasia, America. The height of this predator can range from 65 to 85 centimeters, and the body length reaches a value of 101, 155 centimeters with a weight of 30 to 60 kilograms and maybe more. After three years of life, Having gained almost 55 kilograms, the wolf is considered mature. Wolves don't howl at the moon. This method of vocalization is a way of communicating between members of a group over long distances, for example, to gather before hunting. With a long, drawn howl, they transmit messages to their relatives, and wolves are able to hear and understand the meaning of the signal, even from 15 kilometers away from its source. Wolves also how to inform potential rivals from neighboring packs of their presence or to attract a partner. As a rule, if one wolf starts howling, then his relatives immediately join him. As a rule, wolves show their activity at night, accompanying their hunting with a long, drawn howl as a means of communication between their own kind. When a pack hunts or pursues prey, it tries not to make unnecessary, much less loud noises. In the daytime, like most predators, wolves are in their hiding places. These predators have rather delicate hearing, but their eyesight and sense of smell are a little worse developed. Wolves are characterized by high endurance and reaction speed in addition. They have high intellectual abilities, which allows them to survive in extreme conditions. Wolves are able to chase potential prey at speeds of up to 60 kilometers per hour, covering at least one hundred kilometers per night. The wolf occupies the position of a super predator in modern ecosystems, and its removal from them does not lead to anything good. Thus the wolf population in the Yellowstone National Park in the USA was completely exterminated at the beginning of the last century. Because of this, the number of moose has increased, which adversely affected the trees growing in the park and led to a general deterioration of the environmental situation. The basis of the diet of wolves is food of animal origin, although in the southern regions wolves can eat fruits and berries of wild plants. The diet is very wide and consists of wild animals such as small rodents, hares, ungulates, both domestic and wild, birds and carrion. Living in the tundra, wolves hunt female deer, fawns, geese, lemmings and voles. Predators living in the mountains feed on mountain sheep, tarbagans, hares, etc. Wolves are quite intelligent animals, so they use various tactics for hunting, depending on various external factors. As a rule, wolves hunt in small packs while each animal knows its responsibilities. Adults eat about 5 kg of meat per day, while the minimum diet consists of at least 1.5 kg. If you can't eat all the food, the wolves hide it securely. Wolves usually live in packs of six to ten individuals, led by dominant heterosexual couples. The leaders of the pack are commonly called alpha wolves and, according to many, they gain dominance by brute force, crushing the rest under themselves in bloody battles in order to literally climb up the hierarchical ladder through their bones. This point of view is widespread and fundamentally wrong. During the mating period, the behavior of both females and males changes towards aggressiveness, but after the end of this period, the behavior of the pack becomes favorable for the growth and development of future offspring. The female and male arrange their lair in safe shelters. Wolves often adapt abandoned burrows of other large animals for this purpose. The location of the lair is such that the female and male feel the danger in advance. Wolves have practically no natural enemies, with the exception of humans who thoughtlessly destroy many animals including wolves. Therefore, we can safely say that only human are able to influence the number of these animals, which are also called forest orderlies. The insufficient number of these forest attendants often leads to outbreaks of various diseases among animals. In winter, gray wolves have very dense and fluffy fur with a short undercoat and long protective hairs most of the undercoat falls out in spring and grows back in autumn. Winter wool is very resistant to cold, 
Wolves in northern countries can safely stay in the open at minus 40 degrees Celsius, placing their muzzle between their hind legs and covering it with their tail. Wolf hair provides better insulation than dog hair. It does not collect ice. Wolves travel long distances, and they can play an important role in the spread of diseases. Infectious diseases spread by wolves include brucellosis, chalamia, listeriosis, and anthrax. Wolves can also suffer from rabies, but as a rule, if a wolf shows the first symptoms of the disease, he leaves his pack, thus preventing the spread of the disease. They can run for two minutes at a speed of 32 kilometers per hour, and in moments of danger or persecution, up to 56 kilometers per hour. It has been noticed that during the day, they run about eight kilometers per hour, and can travel at such a speed throughout the day. The area of the territory occupied by the wolf family depends on the availability of food supplies. In winter, wolves try to get away from solid forest areas where there is a lot of snow. The largest wolf populations are observed in the tundra and forest tundra, as well as in the forest steppe and alpine zones, including the steppes. This predator can settle near human habitation and also inhabits territories that are actively deforestation which is directly related to human activity. I hope you like these incredible facts. Subscribe to the channel, like, write comments, and then there will be many more interesting things. See you later, my friend.